council candidate George Great Rex speaks out. George Great Rex, 191 Cooper Road. I have been a resident of Mount Laurel almost 20 years now. I'm also candidate for Mount Laurel Council in this coming election on November 7th. And while I thank you for your past service to our town, I have some very serious concerns that I'd like to share. The first concern I'd like to talk about is what we just discussed, which was reports of the disease cluster along with the flooding. What's particularly concerning to me is that it appears to have taken the report of the disease cluster to have our township officials address the issue of the flooding. I haven't lived in Mount Laurel for 32 years, like a couple of them have, but we heard testimony tonight that there have been at least eight floods in the 32 years that Mr. Kilko lived there. And yet it has now taken this to all of a sudden have the clearing of the creek dump. And that was in contradiction to what was told to everyone who was in the audience last week, I'm sorry, last month at your meeting, where you said, our engineers told us not to clean out the creek because it could make the problem worse. And yet in those last four weeks, when we've been seeing all kinds of news reports, and now we're hearing statistics about cancer in that area, now it's being cleaned out. I have a concern about that. I also have a concern that there are a number of parents here tonight and also a number of our young Mount Laurel football players who are here. And they're here because they haven't gotten the response that they need from their town officials to make their playing field safe. This affects me too directly, not because I know some of them and I know some of their kids, but my own son plays in that league. And I'm concerned about that, and yet what I see is I see that it takes a group of families to come to this council to tell you again about the problem that they're having because nothing seems to have been done to fix that. I'm also concerned about the fact that it took an embarrassing TV news report about the flooding that's been occurring over on Teal Lane off of Church Street to finally get our township officials to fix the, pl the flooding that's occurred in that neighborhood over the past 20 years. I've talked to, the, to all, almost all of those people on the way. I've talked to many of the folks in the countryside. These are concerns that they have had and they have expressed time and again over many years, and it takes something like this to make action happen. I'm concerned about that because to me it shows a lack of leadership and a failure to act when we need action. So I would like to say that new leadership is needed. And, but you know what? We can't wait until the election, especially for Countryside Farm. And I appreciate the fact that you, Mr. Mayor, called the state within 24 hours. I'm not sure if it was me, I would have called at 8.30 the next morning. And we were here at 11 o'clock that night. <laughs> but nevertheless, folks, action is needed now. We can't wait for November 7th. And we hope that you do follow through on those promises that I heard made tonight. Thank you. And Mount Laurel responds.